Hello guys, welcome back to Adaptive Fitness Fun. This is session 11. For those of you who don't know, my name is Jack and I'm going to be guiding you through our fitness session today. We have six exercises. Each session, week on week, we've been increasing our workout time. And today we are going for 45 seconds with 15 seconds rest. So it's going to be a little bit more challenging, but it's only six exercises. Whereas in the past, we've done eight and sometimes nine exercises. So a little bit of a diff different style of workout today. Um, it's going to be fun. We have some new exercises that we've perhaps not tried before. So that's going to be challenging. It's going to be fun. Uh, but let's start with our warm up. Our first exercise as a warm up. Uh, we've done this one many times before. Those of you that have been following the this series, it's a side step. Now we're going to count our reps this time. Instead of going for an amount of time, we're going to be counting our reps. And we're going to go for 10 side steps. Okay, so let's get into it. So you just need to find yourself a little bit of space. As you can see today, we're inside, outside. It's a little bit wet on the ground. So I've decided to run this one inside. We don't need any equipment. We just need space. So I'm in my front room here. We're going to start with our warm up. You're going to step to the side, bring your heels together, step to the other side, and bring your heels together. Okay, and we are going for 10 of these. So this is a great little warm -up. It helps you to think about your balance. It helps you think about your feet placement. And we build this, what we call proprioception, of where our body is within the space, where our body is within, on the floor. A couple more of these. Two. One, okay, now we're gonna be going for walking. Simply step forwards, nice big step, and step backwards, nice big step. And we're going for 10 of these as well. We are building our proprioception of our environment, of the room. Increasing our heart rate, increasing our blood flow, and our breathing rate. And we are slowly getting nice and warm ready for our first little workout. Okay, a couple more. Really nice, okay, we're gonna go for a scarecrow rotation. Hands by your sides. Keep your feet planted into the ground. Keep your hips facing forwards. And you simply rotate round, so you are pointing forwards, and rotate round with the other hand. Pointing forwards. And we're going to go for 10 of these also. Remember to keep those hips pointing forwards. Just through the stomach. You might feel a little bit through the trunk, through the stomach that is, but a little bit through the shoulders. And just building on. Very nice, really good. And as you get warmer, just feel like you could reach on a little bit further. And we just pick that pace up a little bit more. Okay, a couple more. Nine, one more, and ten. Really good. Okay, our next one is called flags. So we're going to start in the middle. We'll make a so as if you're holding a flag. Okay, and again, we're going to go through, feel a little through the shoulders and through the chest as we stretch up. Keeping those arms nice and straight, nice big stretch up to the ceiling. You might notice in my voice, my heart rate and my breathing rate is just starting to increase. This is a good sign. This means we're getting nice and warm. We're getting ready for our, our workout. Again, a couple more. Good. Last one. Really nice. Okay, and now we have arm circles. So arms out straight, and we're going for circles going backwards. We're going for eight of these. So three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And now forward is eight more. One, keep those arms straight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. God, you can feel that one in the arms, can't you? Okay, we're going to go back up to the top for our last little run through. Let's go for these side steps. So let's just pick that pace up a little bit more. Now that we've been through it once, should feel a little bit warmer, a little bit more switched on. That's five, six, seven, we're going for eight. Uh, sorry, we're going for ten, sorry, eight, and nine. Got one more. 
and 10. Nice big step forward, nice big step back. One, two, we're going for 10 of these as well. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Use those arms for balance if you need to. Nine, one more, and 10. Really nice. We've got a scarecrow rotation. Arms out to the side, just like a scarecrow. Now rotate all the way around. One, two, we're going to eight of these. Three, four, five, all the way around. Six, seven, one more, and eight. And we go straight into the flags, hands in the middle. Hold that flag up. One, two, let's go for eight. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And the last one, we got our arm circles, eight going backwards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight forwards. Last one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Oh, excellent. So you should be feeling nice and warm. And now we're gonna start with our main workout. Okay, so I'm gonna use a timer on my phone. And what it will do is it will count us down 45 seconds. And that's the time that we are going to be performing each of these little exercises. We then have 15 seconds rest. So it's quite a short rest. And we move on to another exercise. And we do this six times. And we go around each six exercises twice. Okay, so it's a 12 minute workout altogether. Okay, so our first exercise is, if you've been following this series, you would have done this one a couple of times before, is a star jump. Okay, so I'm gonna talk you through this. Okay, I'm gonna start my timer, make sure my volume is up. Okay guys, so our first exercise is, like I said, it's called a star jump. Now we can just start with that side step, very similar to our warm up. touch the arms at the top, Step together and the other way, okay? Now let's just start with this. And then as you start to feel more confident with the exercise, we can do a jump. Okay, here we go. 45 seconds, guys. Jump those legs out. Reach right the way up to the ceiling. Okay, there we go. We've got 45 seconds. Really focus on breathing nice and deep. Jumping those legs out as far as you can go. Really good, really good. Here we go, we're halfway. Keep it up guys, keep it going. Nice steady rhythm. Don't be going too fast. We have 10 seconds left. Let's get four more. One, two, three. Let's get one more. Four, can you get one more? Five, there we go, excellent. 15 seconds rest. Our next exercise is a shooting star. With this one, we want to be touching the floor, bend down, reach up and try and touch that ceiling. As we get more confident with this exercise, a little bit of a jump. Shooting star. Shooting star. So make yourself a small ball and stretch up. Small ball, nice big jump if you can. Right up to that ceiling. All the way up to the top. Really focus on that balance as you land. Try and land through both feet and press through both feet as you jump. Good stuff, guys. We have 12 seconds left. Keep it going, keep it going. Five. Oh. God, that one gets tough. Okay, our next exercise is called a front to back. We are simply going to lie onto our front, we stand back up, and we lie onto your back. Now, this needs to be controlled, guys. Lie onto your front, stand back up, lie onto your back. Nice controlled, and stand back up again. That's number one. Then turn around, lie onto your front, stand back up. Lie onto your back. Okay, that's two. Turn around. 
Run to the front, that's halfway guys. Let's get a couple more up if we can. Run to your back. Three. Four. Oh. Okay, so four to beat next time, guys. That one's really tough, really challenging. Next one we call a, a side squat. Now, we don't think we've done this one before. Before, we've done squats under a chair. This time, you are simply going to step to one side. I want you to squat, keep one leg straight, squat down as far as you think you're capable. Step to the other. If you've got the option of going to that side, I'm not going to. But I want you to do whatever you're capable of doing. Okay, so step to the side, squat down, really think about the balance. And you're really driving through that leg that's being bent, the squatting leg. So like I said, guys, if you've got the option of going both ways, step up and then the other side. But for obvious reasons, with my leg, I'm only going to go the one way. Oh, that was okay, guys, we've got our wheelbarrow walkouts. I know we've done this one before. So if we uh, if we need to lean onto a chair, onto some cushions, then do that. But if not, walking the arms out like a wheelbarrow, and then walk all the way back in. We haven't got the option of pressing through our arms. We can. Stay in this position, lean onto a chair, and walk the legs in instead, okay? But again, I find that one challenging. That's my own capabilities. So I'm gonna go with the upper body version of walking with my arms into a nice straight plank, and all the way back in, okay? So just like a wheelbarrow. Wheelbarrow races, I don't know if you know what a wheelbarrow race is. Yes. All the way back in. Get one more. Just push that one in. Okay, guys, our next exercise is a squat thrust. Now, we've done this one before, but on a chair. So, last time we were leaning on a chair and we were jumping our legs in and back out. This time on the floor, guys. Okay, jump those legs in and back out. Back in and out. Again, if you need a chair, if you find this one too challenging on the floor, that's absolutely fine. Do whatever you find your own capabilities are. But within this program, within this series, I want to challenge you as much as you're capable to do. So if that means you can do it on the floor, absolutely do that. Just like me, arms on the floor, pressing that floor away, jumping those legs in back out it's a really challenging exercise you feel it all through your body but if this is too much you continue on the chair oh, okay guys that is round one pretty tough pretty hard we have 30 seconds rest we're gonna go through those one more time okay so if you need to adapt any of these grab a chair and we can do some of these exercises leaning onto a chair okay so our first exercise, guys, is a star jump. Get ready in five seconds time. Here we go again, the last time through. Big jumps, touch those arms to the ceiling. Get those legs apart as far as they'll go. Really work on jumping those legs up. Nice, you can hear my voice, you can hear my breath. I'm working really hard. I hope you guys are working too. Keep it up, guys. Keep it going. Nice big star jumps. Okay, we have 15 seconds left. On the last 10 seconds, I want you to go as fast as you can. 10 seconds, off you go. 10 seconds, off you go. As fast as you can. How many can you do? Legs in, legs out. Legs in, legs out. Oh, oh, oh. That was tough. That was challenging me then. Okay, next exercise, guys, we've got a shooting star. Remember this one? This is where you tuck yourself down to a really small ball, touch that floor, a nice big jump up to the ceiling. Okay, off we go, 45 seconds. 45 seconds, how many can you do? In 45 seconds, that's three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fifteen seconds left, guys. Fourteen. 15, keep jumping through both legs, 16, 17, 5 seconds, 18, let's get one more, 19, oh, 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 oh. oh spicy, okay, here we go, we got our front to back, I really enjoyed this one, I know it's challenging, but I gain a lot from this, so we're going to launch our front, quickly stand back up, Lie on our backs. Remember, guys, keeping this controlled. You're not throwing yourself onto the ground. Working hard. So we've got four to beat, if I remember rightly. So I've done two so far. What are you guys on? That's three. We're going to get one more out. Four. Can we get one more? Three seconds. Oh, four and a half. We beat it. That's the main thing. Next exercise is our wheelbarrow walkouts. Remember, guys, arms onto a chair if you need to do this. I'm going to be walking through my arms because this is what I'm capable of doing. I find it much easier than using my legs. Okay, one. How many can we do? 45 seconds. Two, three, four, keep it going guys, keep it going, five, come on, six, seven, One more. Oh, nine. Ooh, ho, 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 ho. Really good. Really nice. Okay. Um, our next exercise is our side squat. So remember this one, guys, where you step to the side, you keep one leg straight, and you find your balance, try and bend this leg as much as possible, stand back up. For those of you who want to go to the other side, do that. So you're going to be alternating sides. If you've got that option for myself, I just simply wouldn't have the balance or the strength in my right leg. And of course, if we find this too challenging, we can go back to our chair squats. This is where you sit onto this chair and somebody helps you to stand back up. But for those of us that need that extra challenge, we're all gonna be at different places and that's absolutely fine. This is a solid squat. Okay. Last exercise, guys. This is it. Squat thrust. Same again. If you find it on the floor, it's too much. Get a chair. Lean on a chair. And jump those legs in and back out. But for those of us that can do it on the floor, here we go. How many can you do? In 45 seconds. Three. Four. Five. Six. Stuff. Come on, guys. 13, keep it up. 14, we're over halfway. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. We've got 10 seconds. Go on, guys. One, two, three, four. Oh, 23. Guys, that was tough. That was challenging. You can see how much I'm sweating and how out of breath I am. That was a good 17 or so minute workout, okay? Uh, keeping us nice and active, challenging. I'll kick, I should say. 
and we did it all inside and look how hard we've worked guys really really well done like i said these ex these uh sessions these this series is slowly increasing our what we call our workload so we we started at 30 seconds and now we're doing 45 seconds and see how our fitness is growing, our strength is growing, our confidence and our ability and the type of exercises that we're challenging ourselves is growing. Guys, you do an absolutely fantastic job. Keep it up. Hope you're enjoying it. I look forward to seeing you on Thursday. Keep smiling, guys. Good stuff.